gonna be a modified desk display area, be like a stand-up working desk. Something fun. Different joinery than I've ever tried to do before. But it should be neat. Some of the corners. It's a really nice size board, mortise and tenon. But on this side, I use my router to get rail and style. I need a raised panel. So I actually have the connecting front and back pieces that way. The whole length. This is the back of it. You might call it the front of it. Depending on how you're situated. It could be like a nice bar kind of thing. But anyway. Since the, the cutter for the router bits, the rail and style cutters. Since they're not real deep, I figured I better span it on top. So I made a, a continuous frame from the top well and the bottom. Like I said, it's flipped, so the bottom is really down there. But anyway, what I was gonna do, what I still will do, instead of putting a baseboard on the bottom, I'm gonna have some thin drawers that look like a baseboard. And then up here on top have some slightly bigger drawers. Um, I think I might have to do it this way. So let's have a nice look to it. But anyway, it's, it's a stand-up desk. In other words, you're not going to put a chair underneath it ever. I'm going to make another section on top. It'll have a flip down. A lot of cubby hole stores in it. The only problem is it's going to be very, very heavy. It's all, so far, it's all solid white oak. Everything on it is white oak. A lot of work to do. In the sec in the center section, I think I'm going to put adjustable shelves. That's it. Drawer in the bottom. A couple adjustable shelves. Don't even know if I'm going to bring them out the whole way. I guess I'll make it so it's possible to do that. But initially plan on having them just set back. But we'll see what happens. See see what I think of, and see what I'll show you next.